the Churchill Gardens, a lot of the flats are like this. They have a door, no lock. Nice view. And so you can get right in the building. To explore. So let's ride some lift. There's just some houses down here. Now over here. Corn and Dunwoody. This this must be an overload thing. This is a Pawn and Dunwoody lift. It's not very good. Pawn and Dunwoody. Now I'm by Otis and they don't do a very good job. Doors open. And this is the top floor. The ground floor is shops. And the lifts up at the odd numbered floors and the even numbered floors are inside the people's houses, inside their maisonettes. This pawn and Dunwoody lift has a bit of a chime. Going down. Please mind the door. Doors closed. Going down. This is a pawn and down with lift. Ground floor. The buttons were sticky and felt like they hadn't been put in a long time. A 60s estate rubbish sheet. And it just goes down in this tube thing. Now to the next floor. This is the first floor it's in the next tower block. So it's there. Which someone is using to go up the seventh floor. I'm on one at the moment. Going down. Please mind the door. Doors closing. Eighth floor. Doors open. This is the eighth floor. It's a view. I'm now up on the ninth. And over there you have the bridge. And there is a train station. Now to the lift back down. per second.
maybe even less than that. Ground floor. Doors open. And I rather like this building. It has two lifts, an express lift and a local lift. And up here on the first floor, there's only the local lift because the express lift only calls the floors into multiples of three. perfect place to do train spotting that you have a class 377, a 465 and another class 377 down there perfect place for train spotting train spotter should come up here and this is the express lift it's not made by express, it's made by foreign and done really and look how tiny it is this is the smallest lift I've ever been in it is so small. Going down. This is a small lift. So small. For some reason, even though it's an express lift, it doesn't have a faster speed than the other lift. And this is the lift. Everyone seems to use the local lift, and the express lift is hardly busy enough to attract many people. It's hardly busy enough to attract many people anyway. So they don't really need an express lift, but now they have one. Look there, you can see if you look carefully into the darkness. And now to Sheraton House. These lifts are not Porn and Dunwoody though, they're Benny! Yeah, these are Benny lifts. Not Paul and Dunwoody. And this is the local lift, Benny. I can see lots of tiny reflections of myself in this door. Come on! Is this lift not working? There's no indicator. The door motor on the floor below was not working properly. This is a Benny lift for really weird interior. Loud door motor, and that's the indicator, and it's not working. Unlike the Von and Dunwoody lifts, this lift starts as soon as the door closes. As soon as it doesn't pulse the safety circuit. Like it tries to get it on all the time. It moves as soon as the door's... And that's a very high alarm button. Benny lifts are known for having high alarm buttons that aren't in keeping with modern regulation.
They make a loud noise when they're late. Door open. The door's closed if you push door open as soon as they're fully open. That's not good. <laughs> so strange. So old fashioned. Now for the express lift. Where the, where the button light works. And, uh, and you can actually see the little light bulb. I can't hear the motor. Maybe it was not very far away. And it, it should start as soon as the door's closed. Benny, it starts as soon as the door's closed. The indicator's working. No pseudo flaws. That's the other lift levelling, that sound. This dot matrix. Good for displaying multiples of three. I'm quite stylish. More dots than needed. Which makes it look nice. There's effect. But right outside this building, look! It's a Schindler. They're gonna modernise this lift. So it's gonna be horrible. This is a sh this is Schindler. How they're not gonna modernise the lift, Schindler. Now at the bus stop where there are some Wright Boris buses. This is a Wright Boris. Missed that one. Gonna get on the next one.